Good morning everybody. I thought I'd come on this morning um, to show you how I store my cardstock uh, ready for when I do my colour combinations. Now you can find loads of ideas for colour combinations obviously on Pinterest but just to make it easier when you see the colour combination that you like is if you have all your colours in your folders ready grouped into colours. Now these haven't got any of my white cardstock creams, crafts or blacks in. They're in a separate folder. This is purely just for coloured card so you can pull them out quickly. Say if you've been on, been on Pinterest and you've seen the colour combination that you want to use. So oh, before I uh, go any further uh, I was going to say about a lady on Pinterest that does um, free planner for those of you that like planners, free planner stuff and she's opening a shop on the 27th. Um, it is Sweet Siren Co. I will put it in the description but just so you know if you if you like your planning stuff she does some lovely lovely stuff for planners so I will leave her name below and uh, you can go and check her out on Pinterest. It's Sweet Siren Co. Right, back to this. So, it's quite self-explanatory, but what, what I do is, um, you know like Hobby Craft do the card packs and everything. So I know which card pack the colours come from if I'm running low and I want to order some more. I just put, so this is from the Cool Water Shades pack and it's from Hobby Craft. HC's hobby craft and then I'll I'll have one in the front with spare card that I've got left over and again this is from the brights just so I know so everything's just bunched together so that's all my pinks together and then I've got two shades of orange and red I don't really use orange and red I'll be honest and then all my purples are together in the different shades. Oops, and then I'll have all my green together in all the different shades. And then I'll have all my yellows together in the different shades. Just so they're all there ready. Uh, like I say, to pull out for a project that you're doing a certain colour combination for. That's that one. And then in this folder, you're going to see the same thing again, but I have to just have a folder purely just or blues because I've got a lot of blue and greeny blue so this is from the turquoise shade again the pack from Hobbycraft so this is where I keep all of my blue card in greeny blues so it's all in here ready to go and that goes from the darkest to the midst to the lightest to more of the greeny uh, blues at the front so I hope that's helped you um, over storage and making it easy on yourself to sort out the colour combinations on the strip and again uh, go and check out that lady's link for all of you that like planning and that's it just a quick video today thank you so much for watching bye bye